Okay, this past week just ended the first eight weeks of MBA school. How was it? Hmm. It was really difficult. Um, working, taking care of kids, um, studying was really hard. But what I'm going to do is point out a few things that I didn't know. Okay. Okay, my first course was organizational behavior um, at FIU. And it's an online class. And it's a lot of information. Um, we had to read the text. And I know I'm saying um a lot, so forgive me for that. Um, <laughs> there it goes again. There's a lot of information. Um, we ended up having two exams, um, which were really weird. Now, one thing I want to tell you. You need to check out Quizlet and Course Hero. And those little different avenues, they're really beneficial. Your classmates are not going to tell you that, okay? Um, the teacher really expects everybody to get together and understand um, the course and how to work together. So you may sit around and hear your classmates getting A's and B's and it's because they're using these different outlets. So make sure you Google different outlets to find different answers. I also had a chance to meet some nice people. Um, the class was really big, so he put us in different groups. Um, it was like 10 people in each group. And I got a chance to meet some really nice people. Um, some people did their fair share of work, other people didn't. Um, so make sure when you're starting an MBA program understand what you're in for you will do a lot of individual work but a lot of the work will be in groups um, we did a lot of case studies and in these case studies he asked us several different questions um, sometimes some people would avoid cat doing a question so they could do the editing so make sure that you do not let the people on your team just get away with just editing stuff because that's all they'll do that's all they'll do um so other things about the eight week course that stood out um was a lot of the paper we had to do individual papers and with the individual papers um you really have to make sure you know what the professor is wanting. Once he tells you what he wants, you should make an outline of it and give him exactly what he wants. A lot of people got counted off different points because they did not give him what he wanted. They only gave him what they thought he, they wanted. Um, so that was one thing that I did do. Um, all in all, it was an okay semester. I don't know what my grade is yet. He told us to wait a couple of more weeks. Then they sent the in, an email around stating that it'll probably take between 7 to 10 days for our our grade to show. Um, another thing that I think is crazy, I thought I had a two-week break in between courses, but they have us taking these seminars. But the good thing about the seminars is it's going to help you with finding different jobs. I'll do a separate youtube video on that right now i'm sitting in traffic so this is why you're just seeing trees and outside um but i'm trying to give you the best information on starting an mba program that starting the mba program at fiu it, it's a nice program but like i say it's a little different but like i say um for other different content i will put a different video on there so what else stuck stood out during the eight weeks and like i said we had two exams the exams were not easy it was off the textbook that he asked us to read and off his lectures and we had lecture every tuesday and the lectures were probably maybe about two hours long and then he let us have questions at the end the problem with that was it was 177 students in the class and by it being so many people, you really couldn't get your voice heard. So he always asked us to email him. The lectures were more of just different experiences that he had in life. 
and also the lectures were about the textbook also um, some of the lectures were some of the lectures were on the test so make sure you listen to what he's saying and at least log in um, for that so other than that okay I went over the quizzes I went over the tests and the groups and the individual casework and reviews every time you do an article I mean not an article every time you do a case study for him your classmates will review your work so always remember you're gonna have someone else re re reviewing your work most of the time when you're reviewing somebody else's work you need to be positive do not be negative the whole point of this is uplifting each other and you got to remember and it's one thing that the teacher always stated by you joining the MBA program you are a leader so your goal of being a leader is to actually help other leaders it's not all about autonomy so just always remember that also what else we had going on um, I never got a chance to meet any of my classmates at this point but we are having a residency next week and I will do a separate video about the residency next week um, I think that's gonna be really good I think it's gonna really give everybody a chance to get to know each other and I'll actually get the chance to see everybody face to face because like I said this is an online course and one thing I want to let you know they have three different ways you can actually take this course you can do an eight month course to get your degree or you can do uh, I think it's like a year and a half no that's the 18 month is a year and a half then there's another one where you do one class one semester and then two classes the next semester and then one then two I think it takes you two years to get that degree I'm doing almost a three-year plan it's like two years and nine months so I actually won't graduate until 2001 so but like I said I'm working I have kids and I have school so that's a lot so I just decided to do one class um, a semester um, but like I said so far I'm liking the content I'm liking the professor I'm liking my classmates everybody's educated everybody um, knows what they want to do everybody is going somewhere and everybody's really nice so I'm really enjoying that so this was like I said just the first eight weeks what I'm gonna do is next time I think I'm gonna try to do a video once a week so I can at least remember more of what the content I'm trying to give to everyone so I think that'll be better if I just do one video a week versus just trying to do it once every eight weeks just to give you a summation of the whole class so I mean like I said all in all it was it was good it wasn't a bad class or anything I got a chance to meet everybody but I would love to know what my grade is anything else that stood out during the whole eight weeks no, I don't think I think I covered everything for you guys I don't want to make this video that long but like I said I will be you guys will be following me step by step on this journey that I'm taking I won't be graduating until 2021 so that is a long time from now so I will be making videos just to tell you how it is and maybe it'll make you think whether or not you should actually attend FIU's online um, business program and like I said it is the MBA the Masters in Business Administration um, and I'll just be giving you guys some tips that people didn't give me because like I said like like I said I didn't know about the Quizlet I did not know and the answers really came from there um, and like there were some little case studies that was in there that we had that weren't from Quizlet but I really think I, what I'm doing right now is I want to let those people that are shy just really it's hard for them to be outgoing to know what is the inside scoop on how to get through the MBA program at FIU so I'll just be giving you the little tips of what everybody else is not going to tell you. So this is my first video. I'm hoping everybody likes it. And I will continue to give you more content. Bye-bye. I'm signing off. NBA Panther. <laughs>